the way I have thought it never happened like that. Okay, now let's make the things little bit near to practical. Hello everyone, so I am here in a happiness guide Rupesh Bhut. I have heard many people talking like oh this law of attraction is nonsense. Many of the client who comes to me, discuss with me and ta talks to me like oh this law of attraction, all this fundas are nonsense, it has no value, nothing like that. I have even read many comments on the videos that explain law of attraction uh, and the deep down comments are there oh this all techniques are nonsense, there is nothing like law of attraction, there is nothing Thing working on this on those stuffs and like that yeah okay so I want to uh, discuss on this part only I will definitely start my wordings with gravity have you heard about gravity yes everybody may have heard about it gravity works on everyone oh you might be thinking oh please don't start this nonsense once again we know gravity works for everyone whether whether it is rich whether it is poor or anything like that we all know that right you have all already given the answers to me that gravity works on everyone the same way the law of attraction works on everyone it's the most simple funda and it is the only possible thing that can happen many people talks oh the way i have thought it never happened like that and the things are always going on something opposite direction what is opposite direction there could be many many opposite direction it can never go in opposite direction it only goes in the direction that you want that you are willing to okay uh, let's let's keep the theory aside I, i'll not talk on, on any of the theoretical basis let's keep it aside yeah all the theories and all are all okay okay i'm okay with it let's talk with the logical point of view let's assume that you think that you have to go from point a to point b you thought okay how will you go you'll think like from a to b i'll start walking or I'll uh, drive my vehicle or I'll drive my car or anything and I'll reach from point A to point B done it's over simple it's as simple as that you thought that you have to reach from point A to point B it's done the universe works in that way okay now let's make the things little bit near to practical near to something that is going on in our life let's imagine that there is a jungle between point A to point B deep dark forest between point A to point B you have to cross this forest and you have to reach to the point B now what would happen you may frighten a bit you may get distorted oh you may not be able to take the quick decision so I'll reach there no you may not be able to yes very true this happens in our life too we want to raise our income, we want to raise our bar of earning money from 10,000 a month to 10 lakhs a month or more than that. But for that, we need to take actions and to take actions, the risks are involved. And whenever there is a risk involved, we take a step back, we think 1000 times, 10,000 times and sometimes we come to the negative conclusion only oh this may not be possible oh if i'll invest my money in my business i'll lose my money the income is not going to grow and something like that if i'll invest my time in gaining my knowledge oh this world is ridiculous i'm not going to grow and all those stuffs done this is how this is what you have decided so you have thought once in your lifetime oh i want to reach from point a to point b and ten thousand times you have thought oh this is not possible this is not possible this is not possible this is not possible so what's happening it's happening exactly the way you have thought it's not possible it's not possible it's not possible it's not possible done okay so so let's make this thing a little bit more weird more near to life let's imagine there is animal there is a tiger in the jungle and other animals also but there is one tiger in the jungle who who is a man hunter or man eater yes the tiger can harm you definitely it can harm you so now the risk level is high yes the risk has increased now you have to reach from point a to point b you will think more you will be afraid more oh how can i reach from this place to that place oh if if somebody kills me or if tiger kills me oh there is a very deep dark forest if i get lost or if something happens to me and something like that let's focus on tiger if tiger kills me and like that yeah at this point of time i would say 
let's talk to the uh, real real life thing at this point of time i would say what if you take the right action in right time and you could reach from the point a to point b now what is the right action in right time what is the right time who will tell me the right time the universe will tell you the right time your subconscious mind will tell you the right time your inner feelings will tell you the what is the right time okay how that is a question let's come back to the story the story of jungle yes so you are standing on a point a with all the things that you want to carry to the point b or you all with your, all your life that you want to carry from from point a to point b you saw two person coming out of out from the jungle two unknown person who you don't have any connection with them they were talking to each other and you could listen them very clearly the person a is telling to person b i just saw a tiger hunted the deer and he is went into a deep forest he may not come out for two days now this is the hint from the universe because the universe has arranged or your subconscious mind has arranged this talks this words to be there in your ears and so that your brain can process this is the right time in real life we will get many such messages in our head at that time we can take action to reach our goal but at this time what the you will decide from the point a in the story oh what if this is false what if another tiger comes in what if the tiger don't like the taste of the deer and he is now hunting for another person what if the tiger is storing the food say today he will hunt for a deer and tomorrow he will be hunting for the man and something else and what not all the stuff that comes in your mind which can help you to not to take decisions or if i make the things clear which can help you to take the decisions which is always in the opposite direction and you got the opportunity oh this law of attraction is nonsense it don't work law of attraction is not nonsense it's working it's always working because the moment you decided oh this cannot work oh tiger can kill me also i must refrain from going the jungle and you thought this thousand times with all the energy all the emotions in that thought you stay back and only one time or twice a time you visualize oh i want from point a to point b and done so just think thousand times you are thinking like i don't want to go to the jungle from point a to point b and i want to be in my comfort zone the law of attraction is working you are in your comfort zone you can't blame law of attraction you can't blame any of the universal processes right law of attraction is always working in all the thoughts in all the direction you cannot choose no please universe only work when i think growing from point a to point b don't work on other direction when i am thinking negative this is the first line that we have learned universe or our subconscious mind do not create any judgments right well that's it i hope you would have got some value out of this video thank you thank you so much and if you think there is some knowledge in this video please do share with your friends and family even let them analyze their life thank you